What's up, everybody? This is Jose from Southern Life. Hey, Katie. We just put some big old wheels on this thing. Uh, Let's see how it rides. Do you like them? Yeah. Do you find anything cool in there? Uh, same. They got a lot of stuff in there. I, I just I just went in real quick. Mm -hmm. Do you want to get anything? No. Maybe later. Hopefully it stops telling us this tire pressure thing. And we got to see what type of fuel economy we get, too. Yeah, sure. I stopped giving us the error signal for the. Mm -hmm. So there it is. Uh, we're in, in Pelham, mm -hmm. not Pelham. I know if you're if you've seen it on a map, you might think it's called Pelham. It's Pelham. And uh, well, everybody in Alabama, it's just about everybody in Alabama has their their I SUVs. Kind of pimped out like this black one right here. Mm -hmm. You see, they got some big wheels. There's a Silverado right here. They got some big wheels. Everybody's got wheels here in Alabama. Just about everybody, so it's, it's just around the back. just to fit in a little bit better and look more normal. We kind of did this. I I almost went with a squat, but the price was ridiculous. You know, lift kits and all that. But I wanted to show you guys on uh, this parking lot. It's like it's a normal thing here. Like everybody, like this truck's got wheels on it right here. This other truck's got wheels on it. That just that's kind of what happens in Alabama. You put wheels on your car. Not sure why, but everybody does it. So everybody's looking fresh, and this yeah. thing's got some stock wheels, and so I, I ended up doing it. I like the headlights on that too. So we're gonna give you guys a tour of Pelham. There's a lot of Spanish people here, everywhere you go, lots of Spanish people. And uh, there's a lot of industry here too. The city's got a lot going on. It's kind of cold today, it's 66 degrees on the thermometer. However, what the thermometer says and what it feels like it feels frigid it's like 53 it feels way cold it is 50 it's 53 it feels cold so remember in, in calero we did the video where um what is this cafe tratuno pizza place oh like are they ready high eh, no? not really in the mood for pizza so this city uh well it, it's kind of south of birmingham back to the birmingham area the Birmingham area has so many little cities and suburbs, and um, so we're on 31 right now. I just want to show you guys where I got my wheels. Right across the street, it's called Tire. What's it called? Okay, tires and tires and engine and performance. performance. That's where we got the wheels. Um, I will tell you this: when you drive slow, you can feel every last one of those grooves and those tires. Can you feel them? It looks bumpy. The the drive. Yeah. Yeah. In the back. It looks different. It, like, it looks scary. The what? Because it bounces and stuff. Because you can see it because it's out. So every time it bounces, it feels weird. It looks weird. The car's got Kentucky license plates? Yeah, it does, right? What county? Martin. Martin. I don't know where that is. I think that's by the lake. So over there is the tire place where we got the wheels. You can see there's cars lined up. I mean, they're, they're selling wheel after, I mean, they got nonstop business. And if you don't even have the money, they'll finance it to you like 90 days, same as cash. You just pay $40 for the service. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's pretty much packed in there. Lots of customers, lots of good selection. They're very fast and professional. So if you need wheels in Alabama, I mean, is it, is it a Toyota truck? Everybody's got wheels here. Like even everybody, it's like, we're you're in Alabama, it's like, Everybody's got wheels on their car, so it's just a normal thing to have here. Everybody does it. Monkey see, monkey do. We did it. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, I feel really stressed out because it's, it's a big purchase. It was almost three thousand dollars the way we got it all rigged up. Twenty four hundred. Um, it, I don't know. Tires were like eight hundred and nine hundred for the tires. Uh, we had to see how they wear out too, how long they last. I'm not really familiar with this brand, but anyways. It feels cool. I'm just, I feel nervous driving it. Like, I feel, we gotta see what type of gas mileage we get, too. That's gonna be another big thing is the gas mileage. We gotta measure what gas mileage we start getting. Ooh. So. A store I like. I wanna reset the gas mileage. Hopefully, it doesn't bounce. They got old time pottery. Let's see how it drives fast. Hopefully, it doesn't bounce too much. You can hear the tires. You hear them? tires that's that's annoying that is annoying that's gonna get annoying it doesn't bother you at all it bothers the crap out of me i think you'll be used that's to fine you'll, you'll just be the one who's annoying well that's not cool for me 
You can hear the tires. I literally could care less. You don't care? I'll get used to it. And you can hear the tires. It's not like on one of those F through fifties where you hear that yeah. like from miles away. You can definitely hear it. I wonder if we have to get an alignment soon. Yeah. Well, we're gonna have to get. Our it won't be a problem anyways. around. It won't be a problem around town. It'll be a problem when we're going these long road trips that we go on. Where it's gonna be like, ah, it's, you can hear. It. Yeah. You can definitely hear. Definitely hear. I think they're gonna wear out really fast. You can definitely hear the tires. They're like all terrain tires. We're heading north, yeah. They're all terrain. They're almost mud tires. I'm not sure if they're all, ter all terrain or mud tires. You can definitely hear them. They got like free replacement within the first year. Yeah. You can definitely hear the tires though. Mm -hmm. It doesn't drive as smooth. This will be fun around town, but on the highway it's gonna feel and get annoying. You gotta see what type of gas is. Let's re reset the. Let's reset the gas. The average fuel coming. I think it's this button right here. How do you reset this thing right here? Nope, it's not it. How do you reset the fuel economy? We gotta see how much fuel economy we got on these things. We'll find out. So this is uh, Pelham. Now let's get into some residential neighborhoods. Whoa, driving it when you turn. Mm -hmm. You gotta be real careful. It like it's more sensitive about the, the steering is more sensitive because the tires are wider. Oh crap, the pole pulled out. Pole pulled out. Alright, a pole you see right there? Yeah, there was. Right there. Hopefully they don't come get us. I was actually trying to speed it up to see how it sounded. I don't know if I like this. It breaks good. You did it. Huh? You did it. Oh, I know I did it. No doubt about it. This is probably something you have to get used to. Yeah. But I mean, until you're used to it, you're just going to complain about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. It feels, it feels trashy. When you turn lanes, when you change lanes, the, the steering is a lot more sensitive, so be careful when you're driving. Mm -hmm. Like, you mind you, differences make it since wheels are wider. Like minute changes at the same one will like like it multiplies it. Purple onion. We've seen that before somewhere else, haven't we? Yeah, like. I don't like around. this area too much. I feel like something is rubbing, but that's just the way the tires sound. Mm -hmm. You can hear them. It's like ooh, like hum along. It's like a real good sandwich place. Right there. What's it called? What's that burrito place right there? Brittle. Mm -hmm. hmm. Mike um, likes it. <laughs> I'm so nervous. <laughs> I don't like the way it feels. I don't like the way it sounds. I mean, it, it'd be cool around town, but it's 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 impractical to a large degree for what we do. Mm -hmm. So, what do you think? Good to eat around here is brittle. Who said that? Your brother. <laughs> the wet blanket. Yeah. Yeah, he's not gonna like it. Mm hmm. <clears> hmm. <throat> Truck in front of us has some wide. Everybody's got wide, big tires now, though. Mm -hmm. It's just what you do when you, you don't question, you just do it. Yeah, you're right. I'll, I'll get used to it eventually. It definitely looks cool. Mm -hmm. And it'll be nice around town, but just being far from home, humming along the road will be definitely a you know, It's not ridiculous road. Like some of these tires, like with the big treads, like you hear them, like you ever see a, you ever hear like a Ford F-350 pass by when they have those big like threads and all that, and it's just like doo -doo 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 -doo. look up that mobile home park that I was looking at, remember? No idea what you're talking about. It was a mobile home park. You have the shop on it, not the mobile home park. There's a big mobile home park here in, uh, where are we, Pelham? There's a big mobile home park here. It's 
it's on the, can I see it? I'm fine. I'm fine like in a heartbeat. There's a giant mobile home park. Lots of Spanish people here. There's a Puerto Rican guy at the tire shop. There's a giant trailer park. I can find it. I think we already passed. Did we already pass it? Oh, we did. Oh, we've been we passed it. Let's get over there. We passed it. I can't believe how far we've driven. We're actually outside of uh, Pelham now. We're gonna drive the other way now. Continue on Pelham Parkway for three quarters of a mile. Head northwest on Pelham Parkway toward Morgan Park Drive, then make a U-turn at. Head northwest on Pelham Parkway toward County Road 275, then make a U-turn at County Road 275. Head north on Pelham Parkway. In 1000. So, what do you think, baby? It definitely, the brakes don't feel as bad now. I guess since the wheels are wider, it kind of, like, helps the shake on the brakes. We'll get me brakes soon. Probably what we should have done. There's a police there on the left. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well, stupid decisions in life are taken. Are you nervous? No, no your seatbelt. You have it on? I didn't see that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, your husband makes really good decisions for us. You know you like it though. You like how it looks? You like it? Yeah, you turn into a little hoover. <laughs> you like it? <laughs> I never said I didn't like it. I just thought we should wait a little bit. And it's done already. Yeah. It's done. What do you think about this place? You like it? I don't like it. Yeah. I don't. You know, I don't like the way it's laid out. It's like we're like, it's all like new buildings and stores for miles. Commercial like well, giant shopping centers and. Old Rad Aid. It's they got a Whataburger and a Hooters. Shut down. Yeah. I just don't like <laughs> what I don't like about this place, to be honest with you. Mm -hmm. What I don't like is that it seems like so commercial. Like, I like small town places. You know, like where it feels small town? Mm -hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. Be careful turning here. I don't know how yeah. far I can turn these wheels. Put all them rubbing. Oh, if we ever get stuck with these mud grip looking tires, if we ever get stuck, we have to like, you know, like in, the, in our front yard where you get stuck in our front yard. Mm -hmm. That probably won't be much of a problem with these tires. Mm -hmm. I mean, you could get this thing stuck, but you'd have to really try to get it stuck to get it stuck. The views aren't bad in the summer. It'll look better. This time of year, it's kind of mm -hmm. crappy. What is that? Mustang? That? Or a pawn, it's a Pontiac. Yeah, One right. of those Nissan Z things. No, that's a Pontiac. It says Z. I'm pretty sure it's a Pontiac. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like everybody there was Spanish in the whole shopping center. Yeah, it was nice. Lots of Spanish people. Don't like being around Spanish people. It's different. It's here we're living a lot better. No, I'm just used to it. So it's yeah, I'm used to it. Feels comfortable. Mm-hmm. Comfortable, you're used to it. It makes you feel like you're back in Florida. Like, yeah, it definitely, definitely doesn't drive a smooth no. We definitely traded comfort for style here. What's this thing? It's a Pontiac. Eh? In a quarter mile, turn right onto Commerce Court. Oh, it's a Pontiac. Did I tell you, but I told you. And what did I say was gonna happen? Exactly what just happened. And when did it happen? Really when it happened? Right when I said it happened. <clears throat> I'm really not a fan of this here. I don't know why. I like a little bit south of here more. Yeah. Like, um. This is kind of like the Prattville for Birmingham. Mm -hmm. Kind of. I know I like being around Spanish people so much. Because oh, y'all sit around talking Spanish, and I can just sit there like a furniture and not say nothing, not be part of <coughs> it, just be pure antisocial. I love it. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, you're pretty much an outcast. Yeah. 
In 800 feet, turn right onto Commerce Court. Yep, you can kind of fade into the background one. That's what I like. Turn right onto Commerce Court, then turn left onto Green Park South. Man, I got the most massive headache. I'm gonna guess this is where all the Spanish people live, considering it's a trailer park. Turn left onto Green Park South. Yeah, we don't really get the better deal of the economy here in Latinos. In a quarter mile, slight right to stay on Green Park South. That's just the way the world works. Just be happy being who you are, where you are, and work, and that's it. Yeah. Everybody gets a different thing going on. <sighs> like a little creek here. I'm gonna guess this is the Latino neighborhood here. A nice creek, I'll bet you that oh, that's the water. Slight right to stay on Green Park South, then turn right to stay on Green Park It'll South. Be a big trailer park probably. People selling tortillas out of the back of the car probably. Really? <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. Oh yeah. I love it. Ooh, this is some good stuff. So when you, you go can really tell it's good. Oh yeah, you can tell. Do you have any cash on? Turn right to no stay on Green Park South, uh, then turn left to stay on today. Green Park South. When you go really slow, you can feel like every groove on these tires. Like if you're going like really, really slow, you can hear and feel like every single groove on those tires. Mm -hmm. That's good. You can drive today. And like when you go over speed bumps, they feel so turn much more aggressive. Turn left to stay on Green Park South, then turn left onto Green Park. Here we are. This is like a trailer park. I'm sure it's all Latinos in here for the most part. Mm -hmm. All the work fans. That's work. good. You can drive today. Lots of swords, F-150s and Chevys. Yeah. Wow, going over speed bumps with these things, you can really feel them. Mm-hmm. You'll get used to it. Yeah, I'll get used to it. This is a ride. Of, it rides worse than our pickup truck. Mm. <laughs> it really does. Thank you, Jose. Oh, I'm, yeah, I'm glad I got it. Yeah. Yeah, it rides as, like, as bad as our pickup truck. Bang. Bang. Everybody's got wheels in their cars here though. Mm -hmm. Everybody's got wheels. Da, da, da. I don't know how like I, I didn't plan right I guess with the weather. <coughs> Sale. I said right away, ooh, it's probably going to be colder up there. I should bring a jacket. I didn't think about it. <laughs> didn't even cross my mind. It wasn't that cold in the morning, was it? There was a sun well, was on. we're also going an hour north. Yeah. It's incredible how much the hour difference does. Mm -hmm. I woke up in the morning. I was outside in the sun. It was actually pretty warm. In the, like, it's a nice. <laughs> yeah, it was actually warm outside. So I figured, oh, it's warm. It's not a big deal. Don't trail it right there. Full of garbage. Okay. <laughs> hmm. The front feels all right. It's the back that kind of like most of that speed yeah. feels weird. The beats trailer parks in Florida. You get yeah. these like trailer parks in Florida. They're like all trashy and beat up and destroyed. Yeah. This leaves like Lehigh or not Lehigh, like Immokalee behind. That's mm -hmm. worse. It's not like it's trash, you know what I mean? I know. Like, everybody's got nice SUVs. And they keep their properties pretty clean. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, there's no litter around. Or... Yeah. There's some cars here and there that look nice. Okay. Most people in Alabama that are Latino here, mm -hmm. um, they have like a, like a temporary work visa or something. Mm -hmm. Or they work in... Rebecca, you hear that? Yeah. Does that sound bad? Yeah, it's not me right there. It's us? Oh, yeah, it's definitely us. It's like a... Do, do. You hear it? Yeah. Should we go back to the tire place? I think it's that back tire right yeah, there. Yeah, we got to figure out what it is. We'll, we'll figure it out. The Where back right tire. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Might just need some adjustment or something. Oh, rubs. It rubs going backwards. It rubs really bad. It rubs going backwards. Mm -hmm. Not sure why. 
When it rubs going backwards, you gotta be real careful. Yeah. Yeah. This is probably a bad idea. <laughs> this is probably a bad idea. We just have to get used to it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It rubs really bad going backwards. I'm not sure why, because it went forward, it doesn't. I'm also afraid if you slam on the brakes, it might rub, like, like really hit, hit the brakes hard. sure why it does that. You're here though, right? Mm -hmm. It sounds like it's down. It's the back wheel, yeah. The back of my side. Yep. The back on your side. Too much stuff to tighten this ball a ball or something. Yeah. Getting louder. Yeah. Go back over there. What time is it? They're up until six, right? UPS. It. We'll get back over there. Wow. It's just getting louder and louder as we go. Head northeast on Green Park South toward Green Park Court. Tires and engine performance may close within one hour of when you arrive. Turn right onto Green Park Court, then turn right onto Green Park South. It might just go away as we drive a little bit. Does it sound like it's getting better? I think it went away for a while. I don't know. Let's go back just to make sure. Turn right onto Green Park South. It's gone now. Maybe. Turn right? Yeah. Let's, let's go back just to like check up on it. <laughs> it's on my rubs a lot. I don't think they can cut 600 more. feet, turn left to stay on Green Park South. Yeah, it rubs a lot. It makes a lot of noise. I'm not going to lie, this ride's horrible. Way worse than... I mean, we've done a lot of wheels before, mm -hmm. but I've never had anything that rides worse than this. Yeah. Even in the Mercedes Benzes and all the cars we've had, I've never turn had left anything... to stay on Green Park South. We put rims on a Mercedes Benz and a convertible. Never, yeah, it was never this bad. Never like this. This is bad. Left or right? Left? Left. Yeah, yeah it rides pretty bad. It rides pretty, pretty bad. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Commerce Court. It does rub horribly when backing up, though. Yeah. That's the one thing it does really horribly. When backing turn up, right it rubs a lot. Court, then turn right onto Pelham Parkway. It might just be something we have to get used to, or it has to Oh, no, it rubs. Itself. It rubs. They have to cut it more. Yeah. Yeah, cut it more. I don't know. It's probably too late to go back and... We'll talk, I'll talk about it, you know? It rubs way too much. Mm -hmm. And going forward is not the problem. It's when you back up where it's like it's like tearing yeah. stuff apart. And you back up. Yeah, it's, it's to the right. Turn right onto Pelham Parkway. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe it might take smaller tires. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's just too much. Or we get, maybe we're, we're going to have to eventually do that lift. Mm -hmm. You know, the problem's in the front. We might just have to eventually do that lift in the front. Yeah. That we talked about. Yeah. We'll probably just have to do that lift like we're talking about on the front eventually. Mm -hmm. And then we'll stop rubbing. Mm -hmm. You just don't want to rub it so much that you start to tear holes into the tires. Yeah, true. You remember our work truck used to do that? And then one day I grabbed the sawzall and I just chopped a piece off the truck and then we did it again? Yeah. It may just be like that. Just after it needs a little bit of a cut. Continue on Pelham Parkway for three miles. It sure looks cool. Yeah, I like it. It looks cool. Yeah, they just have to make sure it's not like doing Rubs something. A lot. Yeah. I just want to go home. I don't want to go back. 
out to the shop, but we, we might have to have that looked at. Let's just have it looked at as a yeah, extreme caution. Yeah, yeah. Because we live an hour away. Yeah, we got a long drive back. Let's see also what the gas mileage says. I'm sure that's not going to be good. Line X. See, they do um, like spray on bed liners and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like if your car's rusty or if like uh, we'll put some like. What I don't get is why it only rubs backing up. Yeah. If you're moving forward, it's not a problem. It's when you back up where mm -hmm. you have absolutely no turning radius at all. Mm -hmm. That makes no sense. It's not a problem going forward. It's a problem backing up. It might be the front. I don't know. Very odd. Very odd. Not a problem moving forward. It's just when you back up, that's when it like really, really amplifies it. I don't like this place. It's kind of like a intermediate. You know what I mean? Like it's kind of Mike's merchandise. Like it's all businesses and stuff. This, this yeah. area doesn't have any character to it. It's all like businesses. And... We gotta see what type of gas mileage we get on the highway with these two. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be the next thing. Next thing. It's got a little shake to it. It's definitely not as smooth as before. Frog video already has one hater. <laughs> what did they say? <laughs> no, one dislike. This leg is okay. Yeah. This leg is not a hater. This leg just means the person doesn't want the frog. <laughs> that content. It's a way of the subscriber saying this is not the content we want. I wouldn't call this like a hater. Mm -hmm. They don't somebody, like the frog. <laughs> maybe they just don't like the content or yeah. context. Who knows? I rarely. I rarely, rarely, rarely hit the I, dislike button for somebody on YouTube. I it's, rarely touch the like button or dislike button. I do a like a lot, but I rarely, rarely, especially if I think the person who's doing it has talent. Yeah, or, or if, if they're good like at... Will, yeah. yeah, I hit the like button, but the dislike... Your destination will be on the, right. the dislike button, for me, is like, if for me to hit that, they might close early. Still there. There's not as many customers as earlier. So oh, there's still people. There's a lot of people there. Let me just talk to them. Like, I'm like, when it, it drives great forward, but when you back up, it's like, yo. Your destination is on the right. 